It does feel great to have you guys back. Let's go meet with Dex. <laughs> v, listen. I've got this delicate matter. That's why I called you. The number of cyber psycho attacks in the city is on the rise. Now that's probably not news to you, but this issue this? matters to me. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get into about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tack hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. Hmm. Chris. Awesome. Sounds good. Yo, Mr. Dude? V, a pleasure. Dexter, Dexter Deshaun, Deshaun in the flesh. flesh. Ample, Ample indeed. <laughs> Listen, bro. Mind if I ask you something right off the bank? Would you rather live in pieces, Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? Uh, Mr. Nobody, don't survive in Night City. Oh, yeah. Either there's somebody, or you fizzle out into none of them. Night City don't let you choose. Oh, but it does. See, in my line of work, I choose to be Mr. Shiro. When folk who try to take advantage, well, they see the beast inside. All right, listen close. What up? Scanning a serious job, playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scab on. Hang on. I got a question of my own now. Why all this, Dex? Why me? Could have had Jack here t bug sitting here. Could have just done this on comms. Call me old fashioned, but I like to look anyone I do biz with in the eye. Had the pleasure of meeting the Jackster in the past, and sweet t bug helped his brother out two years ago. So here we are. Besides all that, Got a, got a special, special little pre-mission pre just, just for you, but we'll get to that. Let me hear you. What's, What's the, the job? job? There's this, this prototype tag, a biochip bio to be precise. The job's to grab it. Simple. No. Oh, yeah. Just like see on the car, huh? Yes, it, it belongs to a core. Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Sure, yeah, that's no problem. problem. No, of course not don't at deserve all. special treatment. Shit, yeah. <laughs> you ain't playing around. Got a feeling this could be a start of a beautiful friendship built on heaps of things. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Need to act like all of them. Second, the Rana. Simple. Klein who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the teams. What's, What's the issue? issue? Resolve with Maelstrom. Got it, beef. Slot and shot. I don't really know how I feel about putting things in my head. We got a classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a military convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see? Convoy was carrying the flathead of a little combat bot, a prototype, and I need me that bit of high grade military tech. Hmm. Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip, and we sure as hell don't get no happy ever after. But don't get excited, it's a single use toy. Nah, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when. Rick was leading. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gang mate, one Simon Randall, aka Royce, plain dropped his ass. <laughs> Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. 
To add to this system, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Yeah, who's the woman? Corporal agent, internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter. So she must be getting yeah. desperate. Right. Be wise to think how you can use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Send it now. Tell me where to find. What's her thing? Why she need to meet me? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Better knew it wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. And the convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone who was skin in the game. You knew. Who'll be there for it all? Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person. And Jaggy's only good at some things. I know, I know you know, know what I mean. mean. Pretty, Pretty much leave you. I think I got it. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. Okay. One more thing is to be. Quiet light or blaze of glory? Hmm? I'm guessing that means Later do it now. silently or shoot everything up. Jackster, talk, talk to Dex. Dex. What up, dog? <laughs> yeah, Cortitos of Big Tiro. Literally a nod. Guy certainly knows how to protect his biz. Wants, wants to put us in a few small kinks. Prep work, I guess, before lining us up a big job. There's this combat bot, military prototype, Maelstrom Klepton. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had to switch up to management. I'm right, heard about that. Royce versus Frick, hostile takeover. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deets of some Militech agent, too, but I don't know how much help she stands to be. <laughs> no. Then there's the other thing. Got to meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. They must know what he's doing. So, how you wanna play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? I say we knock on Maelstrom's door first. Pound, actually. What they? In that case, I'll hit the wall and my nose to the ground. Stick around. Still a way going. What are you doing? My, oh my, look at him. So handsome. Well, thank you. What are you doing, girl? What the heck is going on? Dex already, Dex already paid the maelstromers for the corporal bot. Thing is, can't be sure the gang gangs are still willing to hand it over. He paid up front? Well, whatever. Let's go get this tech. You scheme yet? You got a plan? That shit can go smoothly. Right? This is maelstrom. Gang world ain't too complicated. Might's right. Strong survive. Either you, you fuck, fuck others, others, or you get, get fucked. So, into the board beast den. Let's go, Let's go see, see these bastards. bastards. All, right. All right, let's, let's knock, knock on their on door. door. See if they even open up. Let's call this person. Stop here. Start by telling me how you got this number. No more than a number. Dead. It's a gang like any other, right? You, you shut up! Valentinos. They follow God and... Spill what you know. Don't make me wait. Honor means something to them. 
No, -uh. I don't know how they get it. Let's meet. Cut a deal. A deal? No. Fine. My blocking traffic. First, I take the skyline driving towards the NID. Storm channel under the overpass. Meet you there. Meredith Stout. Take it you were the one to call? Yeah. Blackmail me, fucker! Set conditions! Rude. Got any more for me? Let me go, yo! Christ, Meredith! Shut your trap! That fucking thing ready? All sir. Now answer my questions. Honestly, forthrightly. Are you here alone? Yep. yep, just a little old me. It's the truth. Do a sleep now. He just said it's the truth. This is Anthony Gilchrist. Is he your contact? Is he the one who leaked intel on the convoy? Jesus, woman, calm down and release me. You answer, you answer me, me bitch! Anthony, Anthony Gilchrist! Wow. That, that guy? Never, never seen, seen him before. Check out. Listen, Listen, I know, I know where, where the, the transport, transport is. is. I, can I can help, help you. you. Just, Just want, want a favor in return. In return. <sighs> I, told I told you! you. I, I fucking, fucking told, told you! I'm not the mole! Jesus, Jesus Christ. Christ! Shut him up! Unhand me now before I... Him, you can let go. Wanna hear what he has to say? Uh, you wanna call? I want a bot. Let's make a deal. I'm here, bro. Couldn't have been chill from the start. Shut the fuck up. Tell me what you want. I need a bot. Flathead model. Guys who ripped you off have it. Promise me that bot. I'll point the thing. You have a plan how to deal with them? Could just take it by force, but they're expecting payment. So I could go that route too. Fine, the latter. But on one condition. You pay with our money. Um. <laughs> <laughs> no. no. No, what, what Stout? My, My offer just, just came off the table. Mistake. Big, Big mistake. mistake. Uh, go on. Let, Let them know we're here. here. Just open the door. The fucking door. Yeah, you make a fucking appointment. Cause I don't see nothing in my book. Wanna, Wanna talk, talk to, to Royce? Royce. Dex, Dex sent us. us. Right? Where are you, bud? We've been waiting. Oh, Alright, you be. Remember, we're on their turf. So, so what, what do you want? want? Here to see Royce. We got biz to transact. Mr. Royce is busy just now. I don't care. You got a bot. Model MT0D12. Called a flathead. And? The hell you care? Guy I represent already paid brick for. I'm just here for the pickup. I can talk direct to Royce if necessary. Now, nah, you talk to me. Thanks, That's not the best name there, guy. Man, that's right. You fucking death! Not sick, dude. Well, shit. Those were you, too. 
Tech's not gonna come looking for it. Fuck! They can hop around and try. We removed the serial number and lifted access locks using our saw. What's yours is yours. We're good. Need to see it. Suit yourself. Fucking tricked out this thing. Dynamic thermal optic camera armor. Full cognitive immersion with a raving controller. Picked out prototype actuators made of titanium vanadium Kevlar composite. And watch this! Fully integrated link too, so when the spider starts crawling up walls dangling from ceilings. Mm -hmm. Could lose your lunch. So what you think? Yep, yep. take it. We'll take it. Three. Sure. Yeah. Let's see a credit. Brick God. It's all paid up. Brick God. I don't see any fucking brick around here, do you? Come on. Can't expect me to pay for this thing twice. And who the fuck are you to say what can and can't be? You'll pay twice, because I say you'll pay twice. Alright, you want the flathead? I better see some eddies. Ask you. Steven's already got the eddies for you. What to offer us a discount? Make it. A discount? Uh, you know, you never did say who sent you. Never did say who you're working for. Dexter Deshaun. That's it. Dexter Deshaun. The hard ass who punching animal fought half of Pacifica. <laughs> he ain't dead. No, he's alive, well, and kicking. He sends his regards. So you're gonna consider my offer now?
What was that? What light? God, dude, die, dude. Button node. Fire, dude.
Who got me? from See me again, didn't you? No. Naive, Naive little, little punk. punk. So what now? So what now? Maybe I should look into exactly what you did here. Today was about Royce getting his just desserts. Couldn't have done it without you. Flathead's yours. And consider us evil. I want a perimeter. Secure the area. Time we were on our way. Holy oh, shit, V. I was I sure we'd walk out all in peace? Good work, Thanks, guys. Jack. Solid as ever. Hey, yeah, you too, but, uh... Hey, what's this about? You feeling all right? Yeah, yeah, I want to make, make sure, sure, you know. No. We're good, good together. together. I, like I like how we how do we things. things. I do, I do too, v. v. I do, I do too. too. Hey, hey, let, let Dex, Dex know we got, got his, his toy, toy for, for him. him. And then I, I say I we hit the afterlife. <laughs> you know, do some shots. How you doing, V? v. Well, well. Looking a little put out there, Input. Interest you in a frame, VD? What do you got? What don't we got? Women and men of your dreams. Synaptic acting A-listers, no washed up virtue porn boy toys, or blow up dolls here. Oh, tur stuff. It'll grip your heart and blow your nerves right out of your body. Pure bit-based ecstasy. That's why people come here. Clearly know how to sell it. Not a sales pitch, it's a warning. I'll give you one word. Bespoke. Not for everyone's synapses. Think you can handle it? No, I just want to go in the place, dude.
Smoke? Damn, that sounds promising. I get it, I'm in. Mm-hmm. Couple of things you need to know first. <clears throat> Severe penalties for any unauthorized recording. Okay. No drugs, no groping. Someone catch your eye? You do not grab them. You find them in the catalog, ask for a BD, and get yourself a box. I really look that green to you. Like I don't know. Mm-hmm. Doors open. Have fun and input. Welcome to Lizzie's. Ma, what a sweet little face you have. Well, thank you. Fancy bar. Oh, the pen is working. Hey. Get you something. I'm not gonna get here. So, so curious. curious, the name Lizzie's, is that the owner? Not for a long while, no. And it's none too sweet a story. Now I'm just flat interested. Real Lizzie ran a strip joint out of this place back in the day. Lizzie's bar. Girls were paid right, insured, and had decent security. Good spot on the home. Tell? Yes. It didn't last. No, Tiger Claws took care of that. Tiger beat one of Lizzie's girls real bad ones. No hesitation, Lizzie blasted the guy's balls off. The gang came back the next day. Liz was done. Tigers gave this place up to the Mox in the end, though, didn't they? Sort of. The Mox just had to make a deal with them. Luckily, they kept their heads organized quick. Big boss now is Susie Q. But the side stayed up, out of respect. Biz booms to this day. Okay, well, look looking for Evelyn. Evelyn Parker. You know she's here. Who's asking? What is this? A big, a big tip tipper. Generous, generous when I get the answers I'm looking for. Appreciate the gesture, truly. But I'm afraid I don't get paid to talk. Opposite, actually. It's all right, Mateo. It's right in this one. Mm -hmm. mm. Evelyn Harper. I knew it was you as soon as you walked in. Drink. Drink, drink, drink. Since on, only tequila I drink. <laughs> How do you know? I like to know everything about the people I work with. Either that or it's just a lucky guess. Why are we here? Why are we meeting here? Any particular reason? Actually, it doesn't seem much like my thing, this place. Mm -hmm. I'll take that as a compliment. Come on. No place we can talk where ears won't prick up to listen. We'll be in the lounge, Mateo. Anyone asks, we're not here. That's bad for your health. Dex had a load to say about you. Called you professional, effective, and Thank trustworthy. You. I hope he wasn't overselling. You don't give a rat's dick what Dex thinks. We both, we both know, know that. that. Right? You have you trouble, trouble accepting compliments? compliments? No. Just think, think flattery's beneath you. Am I wrong? Maybe Dex is beneath you. Wow. Have you known each other long? Just started working with him, in fact. I've heard there are two kinds of fixers. Those with stable crews on 
long contracts and short leashes. Loyalty and predictability they value above all else. Then there's the other kind. Dex's kind. Mm. Let's, Let's cut to the chase. chase. What do you, what do you got, got for me? You're... We're tangling with Arasaka, making this heist one dangerous, risky motherfucker. Mm-hmm. Arasaka's poured billions into personality transfer technology. But me, I just want the data on this one. The chip is tucked away inside Compeki Plaza, the hotel. You ever been? Never had the opportunity. You know, just never, never rolled through, through that neighborhood. neighborhood. Damn, Damn shame. shame. The fresh they serve is sinfully good. Chef must, must have made a deal, deal with the devil. So where's this chip hiding exactly? In a suite, In a suite on the top, top floor. floor. The room's, the room's occupied, occupied by Yorinobu Arasaka. Arasaka. Yorinobu Arasaka? He's in town? Don't you read the scream sheets? The media couldn't get enough of Yori coming to Night City. It was all over the headlines. Anyway, anyway, he's heir apparent, apparent to the Arasaka, Arasaka Empire. Empire. Saburo, Saburo Arasaka's, Arasaka's only surviving son. What? So Arasaka, Arasaka Jr.'s planning, Jr.'s planning to grab the reins, reins while in Night City? Only a handful of people in Night City know what the Arasaka's real plans are. Tell me you're one of them? Uh, let's see what's up your sleeve. You know, has got an army around him, I bet. I'm waiting. Top dog like Yorinobu is bound to have an army on call. Hotel's probably a goddamn fortress by now, too. Yorinobu keeps exactly no hustle around. Not one guard. Got rid of them a long time ago. <laughs> Why is that? Surely you know what they say about Arasaka Into. Sneeze in Night City, and a blossom drops from a cherry tree in Tokyo. Yorinobu was convinced his Arasaka security detail reported directly to his father. So we're not jumping the corp. We're jumping Yorinobu Arasaka himself. Hmm. Yorinobu is a puppet. He lost all his cards years ago when he failed to do daddy's bidding. Saburo's had Yuri's balls in a vice for years. Saburo's? I love the pizza from Saburo. and crush them outright if he learns his son's up to no good again. Look, if you've got any spare aces up your sleeve, now's the time to show them. Now this should make your prick perk up. Yuri Nobu recently swiped the chip from an Arasaka laboratory. He's made a deal with Netwatch. Aims to sell it to them. Have, Have you, you spotted, spotted my ace, ace yet, or, or do, do I need to spell things out? Fine. So no Arasaka security on the device, because Yorinobu whisked it away in secret. Now, where's he hiding it? Likely in a specialized container. One that mimics an organic neural environment. On the outside, it looks like an ordinary briefcase. And the case is... You'll see for yourself soon enough. Provided we're done gossiping about the Arasakas. Okay, what's next? Now comes the best part. Oh yeah? Got something for you. Should help you plan. V, this is important. Judy's always been there for me. Always helped out. What? I trust her. But she's a mox. Not the latest member of your crew. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Try not to forget. All right, all right, all right. So, you'll, you'll be a good, good boy. Right. Tread lightly. And keep that tongue on a leash. Relax. Believe it or not, I'm no stranger to tact. In biz or life. Hey, there you are. This is V. He's here for that BD roll. And V, this is Judy, best brain dance editor I know. Enough already. <laughs> hey, Judy. Hey, Judy. Compile your BD. What do you think? Will it do? Still pretty raw, but yeah, ought to do. Mm-hmm. V needs to get deep inside. That's most important. 
So, let's calibrate. Tune it to him. Believe me, I've dealt with worse. Should see the jig jig street porn we gotta contend with sometimes. So, we drop the inside. Let him look, then rummage around, right? How about it? Raw brain dance. Ever taken a dip before? What do you mean by raw? How's this How's differ from the ready-mades? Huh. Ready-mades, provided they're well-made, should feed you feelings and impressions you'd never have the chance to experience yourself in real space. But it's mass-market shit, so it's pre-crafted, hard-coded, fenced-in, and manageable. A raw one? Well, it's more like a virtue and viral. Get to move around, look at things in detail. Editors, Editors use those layers to fish for juicier emotes, emotes and impulses, then, then use them to pad the BDs that go to market. Mm. Sit down, settle in, and we'll get you going. Chairs seem better days. Staying here and watching. Create your sensory profile first. Yeah, it's impressive, right? It's too bad most of the BDs we do here are only good for flogging the log. <laughs> anyway, you ready to do this? Look at your wreck. No way. Let's take a break. Still feel like that kid when. Oh, yeah. I think I'm done. V, there's no time. Get it together, please. Okay. 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 Go ahead. Just need T-Bug to link in. Whoa, 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 who? Runner for my crew, security specialist. She'll tell me what to look for while we analyze. No problem, I hope. Actually, it is a problem. Not what we agreed, Ev. Judy, T-Bug's a professional, discreet to a fault. You can trust her. Why? Because you say so? Mm-hmm. Please, Judy. I'd never, never expose, expose you to any danger. danger. You know that. Okay. okay. Call, Call T-Bug and we'll dive in. Hey, V, what's happening? Bug, listen. I got some, I got some useful footage, footage from Compecky Plaza. Plaza. It's, a it's a brain dance. dance. Compecky? Oh, far as much. Someone, Someone there with you? you? Doesn't matter. Important, T -bug. Please focus. Need your help. I've got no clue what I'm supposed to look for once I'm in. All right, see if I can walk you through it. Jack and your tech now. Mm, you've got to give me access. Opening port 1779. Secure protocol? Good, I'm going in. Should be getting my requests now. Got it. You ready? A millisecond. Okay, connection confirmed. Now some quick tip to ice and. We're clear, clear. Ready to dance. Fire, Fire up, up, Judy. Alright, B, eyes open. Gotta no. find out where your nose is keeping the relic. Holy you crap. What kind of fuck on the meat are you? Helen. She. I felt a fear. You got it under control quick, too. I said, no. They'll have my head for this. Then, you shall perish for a good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute to... Listen in on that conversation, G. Could be something important. Conversation. I need a minute to finish. The program is still in the trial phase. We cannot take it to market as is. 
We shall see soon enough. Please speak with your father. He's taken a particular interest in this project. He can certainly explain the risks. My father's a tired, visionless old greybeard who thinks nothing will change, and he'll live forever in his tiny frozen bubble. I should not even be listening to such things. You will listen to this. Sabro is an adult despot, utterly removed from reality. Stuck in some fossilized vision of a world that no longer exists. Of a world that may never have existed. We have now seen eye to eye for the past 20 years. I am quite sure we want now. Read the documentation carefully. The relic requires specific storage conditions. You must know them. them. Heard that? Relic docs gotta be around here somewhere. Look for them. Do 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 switch on. Lizzie Moon, there's, there's, there's. Heat signature. What's the heat signature? Where is it? Automated turrets. Latest scanner model. Systems all connected to the server. Can you shut them off? Externally, no way. Gotta get in, check out how they link into the system first. Camera's packed with new tech. Motion sensors, heat sig activators, IFF. You skilled enough to kill it all? Mucho more than enough. Just need access to their subnet. Right. That was pretty fun last time. Bedroom. Night set. I've got an idea. Be right back. Oh. Just a sec. Looking for the perfect thing. Ah, uh, you'll like this. Loaded. Safety's on. Good to know, though. Once you're in there, don't forget about that iron. What's this? Scan it. Scan it. Manual details a special tip control container. Relic needs to be kept real cool. So, chip's got to stay in the freezer. Yep, could damage it otherwise. Okay, switch on thermal layer detection in the editor. 
Should be easier to spot where your Nobu's keeping the chip. Which one is thermal? That. Nah. Okay. That. Air conditioning, standard model for hotels of this caliber. Tint matches that stipulated in the docks, but no way the chip's hiding there. Too risky. Tint fluctuations, risk of damage. Okay. Just a fancy ass fridge. Tip doesn't match the guidelines. Won't find a thing here. Hmm. Who's got the case here? Guaranteed. Mm-hmm. We got it. Good work. Looks like we got everything we need. Quit out of the editor. Cash on your data. You were never here. Sounds good. Keep it. I'll put it on Ev's tab. Portable device for handling VDs. I already uploaded the calibration settings. Oh, thank Not you. as sophisticated as what we got here, but should do the trick. And it, and it keeps, keeps you, you out, out of harm's, harm's way. way. Clever. Speaking, Speaking of harm's, harm's way, way, know what, know what I, I see, see looking at you? 
Walking, Walking talking, talking corpses. corpses. Relax. I got it all under control. If you fuck up and they come knocking on my door, Judy, relax. It's not gonna happen. Evelyn, please. No shortcuts. You go that route, city will always win. So be careful. Of course I will be. Besides, we'll talk in a bit. Let's walk. walk. Alrighty. Well, what do you think? To try you to hide your sure everything is under control. Maybe so, no what? What now? now? V. v. Do this do job, job for me. me. I mean, I mean me alone. No splitting the payout with anyone else. No middlemen. No decks. You want to haze our fixer? Our fixer. I knew something was up. Dex is a middleman. And a useless one at this point. Evelyn, you don't mess with fixers. That's the one rule every merc in this city knows. And actually follows. But if we're smart... Doesn't matter. A mistake like that will cost you a rep. Without a rep, you're nobody. You sure you want to do this? Better ask yourself that question. Do you want to spend the rest of your days blasting scabs? Or become a legend overnight? You're I want to be a legend. If I agree, there'll be hell to pay for sure. I know. Whatever, Whatever you decide, you decide it stays, stays between us. I can offer 50%. Eddie's, Eddie's enough, enough to do whatever the hell you like. I'll be, I'll be finished. finished. Dex, Dex won't, won't forgive a dirt move like this. Dex, Dex isn't the only fixer, fixer in town. town. But my yeah, offer's the only one you'll ever get. <sighs> Let me think, think about, about it. it. Mm-hmm. If you need me, call. I'll send, I'll send you my you number. number. Okay. okay. Good luck. Now go. I need a few words with Judy. How are things looking, Mr. V? Turns out Evelyn's recording from Compeki was worth our time. Beautiful. T-Bug already called. Said she's working her magic. We're all set. Ready to go. What now? Now we do the job I hired you to do, grabbing that pilot ship. We'll talk about the rest at the afterlife. See you there. Great. Be there in no time. See you, Mr. B. Another message? Come on in. I, I get a lot of messages. So there, I hope you enjoyed. Look forward to Come seeing you in the next one. Alright. Tell me what to do. Man.